Guys, here today we're going to start on another Boon Boonger helmet. This is Boon Black. Uh, this failed, but it's just here for just here for illustrative purposes. Awesome model by Zero Hero. Uh, he pulled out black and orange for me in record time. I'm so excited to get these going. Uh, again, this failed, so I get a, I have a new one printing right now. I had not used the model with my printer, uh, but I'm excited to do this one. I think orange and black are kind of the coolest ones. But we're going to get some spot play on this, and then we're going to start sanding! Let's go! Just a little update, the back and the tire are gonna get wet sanded. These are ahead, so we're gonna get paint on the rim and the front. Try to move forward since we're gonna do silver on the front as well. So that's the plan. I'm trying to get this done in time. I'm hoping we can pull it off. ready to put together so we're gonna glue the tire and the rim and the visor in magnets elastic and we'll get to the spin around And finally, the final, as of now, Boon Boonger, Boon Black, looking delicious. Zero knocked it out with these models. We could do a little bit better work on this, but we did this in a day and a half. Can't really expect too much more, I guess. <laughs> we made it work. But I, I love this one. It's not, I don't like it as much as orange, but I do like the extra gold around it. That kind of like makes it pop for me. I really like how black and orange kind of like their own like not little team, but you know, like go on wingers or something like that. You know, they got their own little thing going on. But I hope you enjoyed us trying to get these all out. Shout out to Zero for getting me black and orange as quick as he did. Uh, it does seem like there are different mouths on at least orange, pink, and black, as far as I can tell from the new artwork that just came out like uh, yesterday or something out of a magazine. Zero is working on getting that fixed up. He also added the silver rim to orange so his models are going to be new and up to date he has the whole team done now aside from updating the mouth potentially we're not 100 percent sure yet but so you'll be able to pick those up over on his cg trader i'll put it down in the description or his instagram you can hit him up for him if you're interested in these models again zero did a crazy job shout out to 3dc uh, 3d command center for getting red for me done super quick same as the zackers he got them done super quick even without seeing this little extra part here and he said he is going to update his files so look out for them too if you're interested there's going to be a lot of options for the boom boomers out there i'm probably going to redo my first three with zero's new files just so they're all consistent with this nice little part here but that's my plan 
I'm happy with them for now for placeholders. I think they look good together, and you can't really tell unless you look from the side. So, but hopefully everyone's excited for Boom Boonger. It is dropping literally this weekend. It's gonna be hopefully fun. I love the start of new seasons. It's always interesting to see where they end up going the series or just the tone of it so i'm looking forward to it hopefully everyone else is we get over the initial shock of these just being tires on the front of helmets and i've come to really enjoy them hopefully other people can too uh, the metro cool which brings me to the changers shout out to los i'll put his instagram down in the description but he has a 3d model for the boom changer boom changer even has the holster and everything i ran out of resin i didn't have time to print the holster i just did a quick paint job on this just to show you uh, how great of a model this is it's really great separated very nicely goes together super well uh, mine was kind of the guinea pig but it, it worked out great i might size mine up a little bit but this is also kind of a nice size i think with the holster on it it might be close to like the actual prop size i'm going to assume the dx is one to one but if you're interested in getting a morpher to print uh, make sure you check out Los. Great things. Uh, here's a little spin around video of the actual model. So if you're interested in seeing how it looks without my disgusting paint job, here it is. Uh, again, great work. He's apparently working on the orange and black morpher that I'm going to try to snag as soon as it gets done as well. I'm going to see if I can print out a graphic to put here where the speedometer area is on the changer. But yeah, this is awesome. I'm really looking forward to using this. A couple TikToks, so check him out if you're interested in that. Check out Zero if you're interested in these files. Also, 3D scenes, Zachary's have files, uh, but these ones are zeros. But uh, let me know down in the comments what you think of Baboonger, what you're looking forward to, what you're most excited about. Just let me know, and hopefully we'll get that Six Ranger out as soon as possible once we get some leaks. But as always, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter. Stickasaurus, Facebook, Stickasaurus, Cosplay, and Props. Twitch, Stickasaurus Rex, we're live every Saturday, Sunday, twice a day, working on these helmets live for your entertainment. Also, check out the merch store. We've got cool t-shirts, mouse pads, coffee cups, whatever you're into. Check out the Discord. Come hang out. Tell me what you like about these helmets or what you don't like. Uh, lots of people there to have a discussion with Toku-related things. And also, check out the Patreon $1 tier. Just got a fresh new video up. Uh, beginning of this week so make sure you come give it a look it's exclusive we're also working on a bunch of community building helmets there's files and everything so if you're interested in that come check it out as always i'm stick of source i'll see you boon